As part of this collaboration, we really wanted to go beyond just the use of emerging technologies and see how students could be at the forefront of their learning and create meaningful change in our community and beyond. And the robotic restaurant was an amazing example of how students could do this and really lift the ceiling of what was achievable for young people. The purpose of our program was focused around our mission statement to provide daily necessities to people who need it the most. So we decided to create a restaurant with our robots showing off our robotic skills, but also raising money for Forage Supply Co, who are using the money to build pods for homeless people to help reduce the amount of poverty in South Australia. We drew a mind map up to decide what our purpose would be for this project. So we decided on daily necessities for people who need it the most because we feel like homelessness is a real problem in South Australia and we need to do something about it. We really identified the need to address social problems with the youth and, and make them understand the complexities to all these social problems and conundrums and challenges, um, the importance for them to understand and build a relationship with food and, and to abort this consumerist attitude towards it. Our social attitude towards food and nutrition is one of many social challenges that we face in, in society today. The purpose of collaboration is to now show the wider world on you know, the importance of collaborations with students and to show what we can do together to help a community. One of my jobs was actually talking about collaborating with other people in the real life business industry, which is something that me and the rest of my group in project management actually had to work on. So the collaboration is really important in order to foster these guys with their ideas and just setting them up to succeed where they're not hitting too many speed bumps along the way, which is, I think is really important uh, to build confidence and just create an environment where they can bounce ideas off each other and learn from our mistakes that we've done in our business so far. So. And that's a really important thing to get you know, a lot of confidence in the next generation of these kids at the moment. For the event, we were having some people come in to have a dinner at our school, which we set up to look like a restaurant. We would have our robots running to show what food we were serving and what we can do with our robotics, along with presentations from students and people, and people having the dinner to raise money for Forage Supply Co. Along with the rest of the building team, we created first a base model of the robot. We refined it over time. We had to make a code that can sense whenever something's in front of it or is pressed by a push me button on top. Eventually, we copied it and mass produced it, making around 10 to 12 other robots, which we then used on the day. I feel like helping poverty is a really important thing, especially here in Australia, where quite a lot of people on the streets and they need help. So um, I really liked working with Forage Supply Co to help make that change. Oh, I definitely enjoy working with others. Uh, I feel like that helped me get out of my shell and working with the people that I wouldn't usually work with. I feel like I contributed to the whole project, so it felt good. One of the major things I enjoyed was actually on the night of the presentation and it was just learning more about public speaking, becoming more confident and I feel like that really just benefited me in a great way. It felt really good seeing all of our efforts come together and working on the night we'd been looking forward to all term and having all the influential people there to see it. One notable thing was when we went out to visit the pod for the first time, it made me and I assume the rest of the class realise that what we were doing would change someone's life for the better. The students have been fantastic to work with. They're so passionate about this now and they've really, really jumped on board the forage philosophies and you can see it coming through their personalities now as well. So seeing them from the first day that we came in and did the speech to now, it's fantastic. And be able to get the pod here tonight, the excitement of the kids to be able to work with some, some of Adelaide's best chefs as well. You know, it's, it's great to see the reward and then we're really excited to see what they can bring in the future. Students did an amazing job bringing all the different elements together, working with a whole range of different industries, from the food networks that we tapped into, to Forest Supply Co as our major collaborators, and working with our own Food Futures program at Seton High School to put together an amazing night. 
It was so fantastic to see when we lift the ceiling and allow students to drive their own learning what's truly possible in regards to entrepreneurial approaches to education.